Hello everybody and welcome back to my time at Sandrock where today Ooh, yes we get to go and see uh, how Jan is going to take my um, position on the leaderboard yeah that's what we're going to do I need to do some social observations would you accompany me mm. I've heard you receive commendations for being outstanding in your field. Well done. Finally, someone in this town I consider as a peer. I yeah. want to know how you can maintain such consistent levels of energy. What's your secret? Are Fang and his machinations behind this somehow? It's the bird, isn't it? I want to know how you can maintain. Okay. See you later. Very strange. Okay, a letter from Unsure and my workshop ranking. In a remarkable turn of events, it seems that you clutched the number one spot for workshop ratings last month. You even managed to best me, Yan, president of the Commerce Guild. Don't worry, I'm taking it very well. I'm not resentful in the slightest. I will, of course, have a committee looking into how you managed to achieve this just to make sure everything's on the level. But until then, enjoy the spoils of victory. Thank you for the spoils of victory. Uh, no, spoils of victory subject to reclamation. If it comes to light that the rating in question was achieved through extra regulatory means, congratulations if you really did win. Your friend and supervisor, Jan. <laughs> Unsure. Something's happened to my house. Need you to help figure it out. Thanks. P.S. My house is next to the civil court. I used to live up by the church way back in the day, but I moved closer to cut down on the commute. Now I have a lot more me time. Anyway, thanks again. P.P.S. Next to the civil court building. Unsure. Okay. Well, before we do that, though, we want to... Actually, I'll take the horse. Uh, and I will see if I've got water to water these crops as well. But I won't worry about harvesting yet. I just don't want anything to die or to not grow or whatever. Okay, uh, do I have commissions outstanding today? It was kind of a crazy, crazy day last time. It really, really was. So I think I've still got things left to do. Right, I need to get coarse leather. I need to get jute. I may have already got it though. I need to get petrified wooden sticks on the go or get the petrified wood for it. And I need to catch fish to make fish porridge. Okay, fine. I made one canvas. That makes me think that I don't have enough jute. Uh, let's see. I already own... Oh, right. I can make the five that I need for the mission already. So I clearly went and got those off. Mister last time. Um, what's his face? Zeke. That's the one. We clearly went and got some off Zeke last time. We're still trying to make this thing. Uh, and that looks like I, I've got the stuff for it. Perfect. So we've got the desert stall and I think we have the rice cakes as well. So that is all done. Perfect. Uh, no food for chestnut today, apparently. Chestnut really likes the mushrooms that I've been growing. So, yeah. Okay, that's good. Um, I will try and add a few tomatoes as well. I know that horses hate potatoes. I don't know about chestnuts. Mushrooms are really good, though. Super duper good. Now, I want to know, like... Stable on... Can lead or change name. But I'm sure you can like level up the horse, but I just don't know how. Feed or raise. How do you raise the quality of a horse? I don't, I don't know that. Maybe the Fang Special X is how to raise the quality of a mount. I'm gonna try some feed some Special X and see see what happens with it because I've got it now. It's a thing. All right, let's uh, head in and see if we can do the do the ceremony, the yearly Commerce Guild ceremony. Greetings, subordinates. Looks like not all of you made it. 
Nevertheless, it is fortuitous some of you are indeed here to witness our prestigious ceremony. Who didn't make it? Me aunt here. Uh, looks like Butch might be here, looking at the eyebrows. <clears throat> Let's just cut to the chase. You builders have all carried out numerous tasks, picked up commissions, done, uh, things. Many of which were menial and unfulfilling. Some of them, I assume, were helpful to our city in some way. Many, many of the things I did were helpful in many, many ways. But one of you stood out among the rest. One of you went above and beyond the call of duty and built more buildier than any builder has ever built before. <laughs> er, uh, in the last year. It is with great pleasure I, President Yan, on behalf of the Commerce Guild, hereby present the esteemed award for Workshop of the Year. To me. And the award goes to... What, what, what the? I thought I... What, what is this word? This isn't my name. How do I even pronounce this? Sheila. Hey, that's you. You won. Go get your award. I assume that if you don't win, there'll be a different cutscene. But I never want to know what that cutscene looks like. <laughs> I win! I win! I win! So we're back to zeros again. Ooh. Well, won't that be interesting? And Yan is also a four-star... Um, ranked workshop so that therefore can take the same sort of commissions i can so that's why he's staying up there with me interesting okay what we're we gonna do now we could hand in the yeah i'm gonna do that let's find the mission first so i know where to go but let's hand in the bring a smile quest i feel like that would be good and then I'm going to go back and see what I can do about my commissions. Um, I need coarse leather for that one. That's being made. I don't know about the petrified wooden sticks. And I need to catch fish for the fish porridge. So that's where I'm at with it. Oh yeah, and I wanted to check out my mount as well. Okay, oh, it looks like it's going to Mabel. That makes sense. Very nice, very nice indeed. Oh, Chestnut, could you like please get out of the way? Because like, you know, I'm doing a thing here. Right. Ooh. Well, I'll be. This looks delicious. Looks like Owen and I got a new com competitor in town. Thank you. Tomorrow we can get set up so we can start our little bring a smile campaign. Have a meeting me tomorrow afternoon at two. Very well. I shall keep that on my on my hot on my uh. Pinned, uh, my pinned quests, that's the one. I'll keep it on my pinned quests. And then we can make sure that we're there in time. Oh yeah, rose willows are really good for increasing the soil fertility. Fantastic. So, why don't we... Some more straw grid down. I'll see if we've got some more more of those rose willow things. Yeah, we do. Just trying to keep the growing going. Lovely. Oh, it looks like there's also that to harvest. Another level three, wonderful. And that's my last rose willow seed for now. I was given raspberry seeds as well though. So where are they? Tomato seeds, okay, I can put those in. Where are the raspberry seeds? Got 12 Duke cantaloupe seeds somewhere. I thought I didn't have any for the longest time. Hmm. 
Hmm. Chestnut seeds for chestnut trees. I've got a coffee tea tree as well. Raspberries. There we are. Raspberries were from Nia. Lovely. Lovely stuff. Uh, so what else have we got? Broad beans. Pretty. Rhino horn cactus is always a good one. Oh, okay, they're tuba twos. So we won't be able to do those at the moment. Are we still waiting for rhino horns? I think I might be. I might need to do a new straw grid for them because um, I could have absolutely sworn that I had some planted. Or maybe I was waiting for space. I honestly can't remember because there's a thing we need to do for a Burgess that involves those. Flower gate and I don't have the rhino horn. I think I'm just going to plant them. I'm going to get a new straw grid and plant them, I think. And if I want to keep that afterwards, I will. Um, it might not hurt to expand my farming. Like I say, it's all nicely in line with my gate and everything, so I feel like it's quite... Quite a nice place to have those things, and I'm probably going to move my door, and then probably at that point, I'll probably have. I might say probably some more time, Sheila, uh, but probably at that point, I'll I'll be expanding out this way, so that the um, animal houses will have somewhere to go, or if not, then I'll try and fit them in by the barn or something. Talking about the barn, I do still need. I think I need more uh, of everything. <laughs> see how far I've gotten with it. Um, six out of ten of the iron plates. I've got all the hardwood planks, so I need another four iron plates if I can. And then I need to make the bronze frames. Let's see if I've got enough iron to make four iron frames. Plates, even. I do, so that's a good start. That We're getting a bit closer to poor doodles having an actual home. Um, it looks like we don't have enough for the petrified wooden sticks, so I'll need to go out to the desert and get something for those. Looks like we're nearly there with the canvas. And let's see about the bronze frames. I can make one, but then I'll need four bronze rivets for the other. Well, that's that for there. That's that for now, anyway. Um, what's my main quest at the moment? Hydroponic incubator. Let's get that going on the assembly table, shall we? see what I've got. So, chromium steel bars? No. I kept giving those out as presents, unfortunately. So, I need to make some more, and then we need to get, uh, oh yes, we needed to get some of those fibre things. Uh, what are they called? You know the ones, the fibre that you get from the, uh, the clotty bits that you get from the gecko station. <laughs> yeah. She's up so specific today. So let's make the chromium. And what I'm going to also need to do then is to restart a contract. Stairs. 
start a contract with uh, Rocky because it's the, a new year. So, new year, new contract, apparently. Let's see how much that's going to set me back. It's worth it, though. It's worth getting it upgraded as well. I just couldn't afford it for a, a long, the longest time. All right, so 7,427... How much do I have? Oh, 19,000. Okay. Uh, upgrade it for 2,500. Oh, no. Upgrade it to 2,500 for 14,000. I don't have enough money to even do that. So I cannot upgrade to the next bit but it'll be a whole year's worth once I do get the money together so if I can that'll be so worth it um, level one of three probably want more of the deluxe scrap so wood mechanical scrap and copper scrap I want some but this is going to be more worth it to me power stones I'm absolutely fine with how it's set and I do not need relics So, show details. Oh, you get rubber scrap from the basic scrap. That is quite useful as well. And you get all these different... So, I've already got the space suit. I've already got the jeweled egg. I've already got the candlestick. I've already got the chalice. DNA model. Spaceship model. Sa all the sand eagle. Golden uh, bull head pieces. Everything. I've got all of them. So, do not need relics. Condensed power stones might be nice, but do not need relics. So that's fine. I had such a good day yesterday for making friendship points, though. So, oh my goodness, making friends was amazing. Oh, I have a sandy plan today, okay? So it's going to involve a little trip to Vivi's place, okay? We're going to go to Vivi's place, right? And um, we're going to um, buy all the leather. All the pigment. And all the rough cloth. Okay. Hey, Macchiato. You want to go on a little digging quest? See you later. Have you seen Banjo lately? I need to find, to find Banjo. So, the sandy plan is to then go to the tailoring bench. And then send Nemo off on a digging expedition too. Tailoring bench. And at my tailoring bench, I shall make three sand hats. Because Sandy likes sand hats, I found out. And it's one thing that I can I've been able to make from the very beginning. And is a really high level thing with him. It's just a case of spending a bit of money, or, or her even actually, probably. Um, so just a case of spending money at Vivi's on a little bit of materials, and I can just make those sand hats. And it's one of the better, well, it's almost one of the best presents. I think there might be other presents that are better, but they're harder to get. So yeah, sand hats for Sandy, all the way. Wish I'd known that last episode, because then I would have got the double thing for it. But also, do we know Sandy's birthday? Probably not, actually, because um, we don't have the... No, I don't think we do. Mabel's birthday's in a week, though. Do you know? X's birthday on the 11th, Miguel's on the 9th. Oh no, that's a winter. We're in spring now. Tomorrow, it's Owen and Rocky's birthdays. Wow. Now, I think that um, Rocky, I'm going to try maybe giving him gold. Maybe try giving Owen food or ingredients. I don't know. Or maybe I could just try with like opals for them both or something. I'm not certain. Opal seemed like a really good one. 
So maybe that would be the thing to do, because I do need to go out to the desert anyway. Uh, can I hand in? I think there's commissions I can hand in around here somewhere. Hey, I'm sure. Oh, I must have his canvas ready. Nice. I've run out of fuel as well. Winning the Builder of the Year award? That's kind of like becoming Deputy of the Commerce Guild, huh? I'm so jealous. Oh, he really Thank wanted you. to be Deputy, didn't he? And he lost out to a cat. Good, I needed this for stuff. Thanks. Right, so... What sort of quests have we got going then? Oh yeah, something's happened at Unsure's home. Let's go and find out what's happened at Unsure's home. I'm intrigued. And then we need to get on with commissions because I desperately need to make sure I, I keep up. We're back at zero again, so... Gotta keep it going. Although Yan had a massive head start. Do you remember? Oh, this isn't Unsure's home. What is the Civil Corps? Unsure's home is right next door. So something has happened. What has happened? What has happened? Your rocks fell over. Did they? No. Happened. Hello. Sorry about the mess. It wasn't like this when I left this morning. So yeah, as you can see, there are rocks all over the place. Someone's been moving them around, I guess. Well, I know you only had a chance to look around for like 10 seconds, but who do you think could have done this? Could it have been Captain? Captain? No. He swore an oath to protect and serve. Yeah, he does come by sometimes, but he's not like other cats who jump up on your table and knock stuff over. Only way he'd ever do that is if there was a criminal on your table. Maybe a rocks just rolled off the shelf by themselves. Hmm. If that's the bookcase, I only have my shelf to blame. Must be a thief. Dang. Wow. Yeah, maybe a thief came in and ransacked my house, but then realized there was nothing of value to steal and just left. How embarrassing for both of us. It'll be so awkward if we put him in jail and have to see him at work. Actually, <laughs> it's none of the above. <laughs> the way he talks is hilarious. I love him. I ran out of space on my rock shelf, so I've just been placing my new ones in random places. Starting to look like one of those old people houses we go to investigate when no one's heard from the old people in a long time. And, uh, sorry. Got too real there for a sec. Usually with them, it's stacks and stacks of newspapers anyway, not rocks. Yeah. So yeah, I need your help. I need a new rock shelf. You know, rectangular wooden object with a series of shelves that stack horizontally so as to store and display rocks rock shelf. Can you help me build one? Of course, but you mean a bookshelf? Well, yeah. I mean, kind of like a bookshelf, but for storing rocks. I probably won't be putting any books on this thing. Oh, unless it's a book about rocks. I mean, I can see why he lives in sand rock. He doesn't even care about the sand, just the rock. You know what? Let's not rule that out. Do you think you could make me a rectangular wooden object? with a series of shelves that stack horizontally that it's capable of storing and displaying not only rocks, but potentially, if need be, books as well? Yes. Ooh, nice. Thought I might be asking too much of you. Thanks a million. Just go ahead and stick it over there on the wall when it's done. Then I'll come home and be like, oh man, new rock case. Oh man, new rock case. Wow. Thanks. In addition to accepting my task, you've also given me a lot to think about. Well, see ya. See ya. Uh, and he needs to organise all those rocks I've been giving him. All those opals and quartzes and... Okay. Make a simple book bookcase out of copper screws, bronze pipes and wooden boards. Well, that would take me not very long at all. I'll just get those bits started and then I'll head out to the desert. And I'll get my opals and stuff. Um, and I will also fuel up my fuel because my fuel has run out. Boop. And boop. Right then. Chromium bar. Iron plate. Bronze rivets. Oh, uh, what were we making that for? That was for something important. 
I needed... Oh, for the barn, wasn't it? Yes. Yes, yes. Okay, so we were making a second bronze frame. And I think that's all the stuff we need. Oh, I need four of them. What? Okay, I'll get another eight rivets on the go. And I've got my iron plates. Okay, that's fine. Please make me eight more rivets. So it'd be four lots of two. Then I also need some bronze pipes. For the bookshelves. And I'm going to need some copper screws. Apparently I need some copper pipes. So we'll just we'll make them. You know, whatever. Uh, <laughs> then... <laughs> I need to go out to the desert. Get coarse leather, petrified wood, and some opals on the way. But I also need eight fish for fish porridge. Um, make sure I've got all the other stuff. I also need a little bit of rice. Okay. Right then. Let's get the fish porridge stuff first. No, let's not. We can do that in the morning. Let's get out to the desert, I think. Got a lot of things we need to do out there. So I'll just go and fight tripeons and stuff until I've got enough coarse, coarse leather. So let me just uh, change over my... I don't need that want to see how much coarse leather I need. Oh no, I need tanned leather. That just isn't going to tell me how much coarse leather I need for the tanned leather. Ah. Also, I need more chromium bars. I think I was already making eight of those though. But I also need one more manganese bar as well. So yeah, all a bit of a pain really. I have a strong suspicion I'm not going to have enough. Well, let's say I need four per one, which is not an unreasonable amount. That I need maybe 12. And I don't have a clue how much wood I need. Petrified wood. So I'm going to need to check that as well. But I'm not taking bring a smile off or I'll forget it. Um, so let me just see. I need five. I think I already have one or something. You know what? Let's take that one away and put that one on. So I actually have enough. Okay, cool. That'll do for now then. So I need to go and fight some like tripeons or something. I think they give me coarse leather. We'll quickly try and see, uh, grab that chest. No, not without dusting it off first. What did we get? What did we get? Armor display piece three. Hey. Happy with that because I am trying to get as many as possible of the relics. And some of them are going to be harder to get than others. And the ones that are going to be harder to get are going to be the ones out of relic bags and out of treasure chests. There are some that can only be gotten out of treasure chests. Oh no, chitin shell. Oh dear. Um, well, it'll have to be boxing jacks and pen skis and stuff then, I think. Let's see how many I can get off this guy. Oh, definitely I can get them off the thorny jumpers. Let's get some off you. So that's one. Boxing jacks are an absolute pain. They knock me over. Oh, I thought I had you already there. Oh yeah. So let's see what we got off them. Four coarse leather per boxing jack. That's not too bad. I know there's others around. I 
Okay, I'm going to fight... Oh yeah, there's one. I don't need to fight the Penskis then. I could try fighting the Penskis and see if they give me horse leather. I have a feeling they're going to group aggro though. Jumper. Let's see how many coarse leather I have now. So probably around somewhere around ten, I imagine. So if I do one more jack, I think that'll be enough. Oh nine, okay. Right, I want to see what the penalties drop. It's a bit sad because they look really cool. They do. They drop coarse leather. Sorry, guys. They don't even fight back. It's horrible. Right, okay. So we got quite a bit of coarse leather from that. Hopefully that should be enough for a little while 16 yeah i think that should be enough to at least get grace her daggers a bit a bit sad that i had to do that okay my pets have done their assignments it's time to go home really isn't it because like my goodness i know there was something else i wanted out in the desert though is it going to be worth the the bad eyes though well i think that's happening anyway i really do need that extra is it a social point or whatever it is? I need the extra point where I can sort of stay up till three. <laughs> Get rid of that horrible eye effect. It used to be that they only gave you like an extra hour on that, but it looks like they're giving you all the way till three now, which is really nice. But I'll get as many opals as possible because honestly, they seem to be an almost universal good thing. To give people as presents so it's like oh i do kind of need as many as i can of these because they're good for fang they're good for x they're good for the cats um avio and amira both like them I very much expect Rocky would like them. Unsure, of course, is going to like them because they're a rock. Unsure's going to be like, oh, you got me a rock. And I'll be like, yeah. And he'll be like, thank you, Sheila. I love you so much. You got me a rock. I don't think there's any more about. I think that's it. And how many did I get? How many did I get? I got nine i'll do come back in a few days get some more i may have to ride all the way home though i think after midnight the yakmel's like nah i'm gonna get bad eyes if i stay up like yakmel are very um vain so i can try though nope we're riding down the railway track then Let's go. I have to stay up really late if you want to do all your commissions. And all the quests. And uh, find all the relics. I do have now though. Because remember when I opened my, my relic bags? I found that last relic for the uh, ruins. For the... Uh, abandoned ruins. I don't know what they're called. I know it's the breach. What are they actually called? I need to know. You Fowler Salvage Abandoned Ruins. Yeah. So we found all of the relics in the You Fowler Salvage Abandoned Ruins now. Which is absolutely amazing. Quick sort all. And to bed. Um, we did make Sandy's hats, but I will start giving them to Sandy in the morning, I think. Because it's time for bed now. I think we did alright there. Um. Ah, oh, 
Oh, has my selfie. Look, New Year's. <laughs> so cute. Oh, number one builder award. I think I was just going to put that on my shelf then, because I think it should be in here, don't you? There you are, number one builder on the shelf. Actually. I'm going to put it over here because that's under my like builder licensey thing. I put it in the middle as well. Oh, are you kidding me? No. It's the wrong way around. Oh, now I'm never putting it down in my life again. Okay, it's staying there. Staying there for now. That's it. I'll move I'll move my trophy somewhere else. I don't care. Right, I need to go to RVOs and get something for my eyes. I want to grab my sand hats. Sandy. Chromium steel bars. I'm slowly losing my mind over what everything is for. Right, one thing I know that I want is the the barn. I'm desperate to get that sorted. So let's do it. Let's do it now. <laughs> I think I have all the stuff. Because things that don't have um, like a mission behind them that I'm just doing for myself, they're so much harder to work out what I need and everything just because obviously it's not showing up on any lists or anything like that. And when I'm going on the machines, it's not showing up on the machines. All that malarkey, so. Ugh, one more bronze frame. Okay. Do I have enough for another bronze frame? Oh, yeah. Right, should be able to do it now. Oh no, it's massive. I don't remember it being this big. Um, what am I gonna do? I'm super sad about that. I do not remember it being that huge before, but maybe it was, and I just don't remember. Oh, golly gosh. Okay, I'm gonna need to move a few things. So the first thing I can do is move the house backwards in right into the corner. While I'm there, I could probably change the size of the roof to actually properly match the house. I have money now. Looks slightly better, doesn't it? Move the animal houses. Um. Okay, that'll do for those. But now I'm just going to move them in front here. I'm sure that I can rearrange all of this later. And then I'm going to move the work table in front of the, of the stable. That may give me enough room to do it. Let's see. It does. It's going to look bad for a while. But I'm not sure that I care because it does mean that Doodles is actually going to have a house now. 
but that's going to look really bad and really cramped until I can save up money. I desperately need to get this um, next upgrade to level 7. That is horrendous. View animals. Alright, okay, so how do I put animals in here? I can add food. Let's get Doodles out then. Doodles is just sat in my inventory. Probably maybe just be able to go boop. And pop some potatoes in there, because I know they like potatoes. Yeah. Enjoy your life, Yakmalkov. You're so cute. Yeah, need more space for all the things I want to do here. Because this is just... This is just awful. <laughs> Look at it. Look at the mess. I'm wondering if Doodles could go in the corner there and I could somehow move everything around. But uh, it's going to be a nightmare. I think it's probably best to wait until I have a bit more space. So, pop a scrap. Rubber scrap. Wood scrap. Mechanical scrap. No, iron scrap. Mm, plastic scrap. Uh, fine wood scrap. And finally, mechanical scrap. Lovely. Tailoring machine. I can now make some of the tanned leather I need. All of the tanned leather I need, in fact. Nice. Uh, I have all the petrified wood I need to make myself petrified wooden sticks. Um, I already own three. I... Mm. It's not saying how many I need for... Saying I need something for the electric kiln. Oh, hang on, Petrified Wooden Stick. Here we are. Four mission. There we are. I need another three. Perfect. Um, right, so. Chromium bar. Tempered glass. Four iron plates. Make me some iron plates, I think. Yeah. For some reason, I need hardwood. one hardwood plank. Not sure why, but I'll make it. I'll queue it up. Might need some more chromium as well. Do I? Yeah, apparently I do. But I don't have any chromium left, and I can't get more. I have to wait for the pets to bring it in, so... We'll just do that, I think. Any good things? Two civil grinders. Make 4,000. Could do that. Chromium steel bar. I don't think I'm going to be doing that. Yeah, I'll take the silver grinders for yeah, for Yan, I think. I'll do the cast iron nails on a swift. Oh, okay. That's fine. Oh, no. I need the iron plates before I can even start on those. Oh, that's fine. I'll get it done. Commissions like that don't come along all that often, so I'll work around it if I have to. Um, I need to go to the stall at, but at two, don't I? I thought it was two. So let's uh, head out on my horse. I need money so bad. This is terrible. I can't live like this. <laughs> at least all my animals have somewhere to live, okay? Shush. Yeah, I like to lead by example. No, you don't. We need to respect nature. I need to respect people on stages. Uh, I also need to respect my uh, my eyes. Banjo, I got you an opal. Come back. Help! Welcome. A few more of those, and you'll be my best friend, right? Uh, 
Andrew's tripping up our view. <laughs> so the next thing I need to do... Uh, do I have any of these ready at all? Nope, 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 and nope. So I think the next thing I can do is to go catch some fish for Penn's one. Very hard to keep track of these things, isn't it? So I'm going to need eight sandfish for this. Which honestly shouldn't take me long. I'm pretty good at fishing for them. For some reason I don't have any sand rice in my inventory. Probably should change that. Mm. That's nice because I've got a large and a small one at the same time. Apparently I'll have a slight, if I upgrade this in the refiner, I can also get a slightly larger radius on it, I think. Which might be quite nice. Certainly make the sandfish fishing a lot faster, doesn't it? If you've got more range on your uh, sandfish trap. But I do have a lot of things like on the list to do. And what I'm going to try and do is slow down just the tiniest bit so that I can sort of make sure that I've got those things done because they're things that make things easier for me. It's probably enough. Uh, no, it's not. Okay, let's uh, go again. One more. But yeah, when I've done all of these things, um, it's just making every it's like quality of life. It's making everything easier. It's having higher level machines that have bigger queues, that sort of thing. Oh. Oh, sweet. Right, let's go make that fish porridge. And then I know that I'm on top of all the commissions that I can be for now. I feel like I probably could do some rearranging and make it look nicer, but at the moment I'm a bit like, uh, do I have to? I've spent a lot of time over the last episode or two doing rearranging, so I feel like I'm, I deserve a break from it right now. I've got the tanned leather, so that means if I go to the forging machine, I should now be able to make the steel. Oh, I forgot to make the manganese bar. Rats! Make me a manganese bar, please. Oh gosh, look look at all the stuff I need. That I'm not making right now. Just make whatever I can. I need bronze, I need copper, I need everything. Let's get it all going. And we're going to need fuel for this. Right. So we're working on my... Oh yeah, daggers need the manganese bar. The wooden stick one is done though. And we could try and find Sandy and see if this uh, hat thing works. But it's not confirmed until I've done it. I should probably be able to build the rock shelf for uh, unsure hey, pretty quickly as well. Hey, was just looking for you. I was just seeing my friend Butch off at the train station. 
you remember him, right? A real gushy guy, really liked your photography. Yeah. He wanted to see you again, but I didn't want to bug you. Uh, he did insist that I share some of his hometown specialities with you, though. A pretty cool stuff, rare around these parts. Mm. Well, that turned out pretty fun, didn't it? Lucian Crates. <laughs> uh, that little photography stunt went a long way. Uh, oh. Uh, hey, I realized it was kind of not cool of me to be charging people for prints of your photos. <laughs> so, here's a little something from me, too. I'll catch you around. Roasted eels. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, and I kind of do need to hand in a commission to you. And are you going to tell uh... me your birthday or something? Oh, no. One workshop of the year? That's incredible. You beat out your boss, and he's been in the biz forever. I'm sure he took it well, being an old head and all. In fact, I bet he's real proud of you. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, talk recipes. I just thought up a new recipe. I'm thinking of calling it tomato fish. I can't wait to get back and try. I'll tell you about it next time I see you. Yeah, will you? Will you? Will Mabel tell me about that thing she was thinking of? I bet she won't. Right, I still haven't gone and done an X special, have I either? Let's head to the store. Oh, I'm a bit late for it, actually, now. But that's okay. Mabel doesn't mind. Wow, it's so tasty. Nom, nom, nom. Ah. Wowee, free food. And you cook this one, she love? Well, aren't you just a bag of wonderful treats? I didn't know you could cook. Here, I want to share something with you as well. It's a cooking recipe from my ma. My ma made it for me when I was just a little boy. Yep, with salt and sand rice, and you get yourself a delicious bowl of mush. Soft, gooey, delicious bowl of mush. I love it. Ugh, maybe that'll be a good present for him. Oh, that just went smashingly. I reckon we done given that little bit of joy to some of the folks around here. Put a small skip in their step. Hmm. Thanks for helping today, she love. And I figure I'll be running this campaign here once a season. If you're ever in need of a little pick-me-up, feel free to drop by. Woohoo! Maple relationship 50. What? That's insane. Yeah. She's practically friends with me now. Gee. Ooh. Look who it is, Sand Rock's number one builder. Of course, you were always my number one builder. I'm sure it didn't bother you none now that it's official, hmm? What are Mabel likes? I'm gonna give Mabel a... Oh, oh thank you. I really like this. Thanks for giving it to me. Then we're going to see if we can find Sandy Camel. Can't believe I nearly nearly missed that. Wow. Uh, not here. Not here. Not here. Hey, Venti. Not here. Usually doing the round somewhere. Sandy Camel is one of the few people that I have to actually find. Cause uh, quizzically question clientele. Don't be afraid to stop by City Hall for tourist information. Okay, I'm going to gift you a sand hat. Oh yeah. Sandy is now my associate. So yes, sand hats. Particularly great. Make sure I have them on festival days as well particularly when is our next festival day 12th and 13th for the showdown so on those days i'll need to make sure i have those things available now when i was farming i noticed i did have a whole load of sand um uh, of cantaloupe jute seeds but for some reason i haven't been carrying them around i thought i'd run out but i don't think i actually have so uh, my last piece of chromium ore for you, my little meerkat. I don't know if I can find chromium. Okay, so let's see if I can find where those seeds went. I'm just sat on my farming chest. Coco, here you are. Your fave. But yeah, I don't now need to give those to Sandy Camel because I actually have a better thing for Sandy Camel. So that's wonderful. I'm just going to make sand hats every time. 
sand hat every day. <laughs> it'll be expensive, but it'll be worth it. Hey, have you guys been out on your on your digging thing today? No. How are you doing, doodles? Um, okay, well I can't really pet you when you're like in your food bowl, so. Why such a tiny yak mill needs such a big barn? I really don't know. Chromium, steel bar. Tempered glass wouldn't be a bad one. Switchboards are really hard to do right now for me. Oh, no coffee at the moment. I don't have enough cantaloupe at the moment. Sand rice cakes would be makeable, I think. Oh, do I have sand rice right now? Because I didn't see that. Let me check. Oh, and I need to do fish porridge as well. I apparently need more sugar. Ah. At least I think I, I don't think I made the fish porridge already, did I? No, I did not. So we need five more sugar. The horse is like super stuck, so I'm just gonna have to wait for the teleport to happen because <laughs> that that yard is a mess. Which is why I'm doing all these commissions, because I really wanna get it not to be a mess, but I think I could do with another upgrade or so before that happens. So five sugar. Owen should have that. Got lots of very yummy, yummy, yummy food that I never ever use. Oh, it's not sugar, was it? It was rice. Oops. Or was it rice? I, I it was rice or sugar. I can't remember. But I've got I've got all of them now. So <laughs> we'll be good, right? Right, okay, next thing I need to do is just go. <laughs> this is the story of my life. Next thing I need to do is this, and next thing I need to do is that, and then I need to do this, and then I need to do that. Let's see if I'll plant anything. Oh, a pomato. Let's put that in. Oh gosh, I was going to put in my. Uh, my Rhino horn things, weren't I? I didn't do it. Lovely. And I can plant things around it if I want to. Do I plant two of them? I might not get six out of it. So yeah, let's just do two to be sure. And that's actually quite a nice size for my um, for my farmland. Then I think. Okay, good, good stuff. Let's go and make the rest of the fish porridges. There should be another five of them. Why it doesn't say that I need them for the... Um, make sure I'm making the right thing. Yeah, I definitely am. That's fine. Let's see if we can make the rock case. Let's see how that's going. Oh gosh, where have I even put my work table now? Yep, rock case is done. Apparently need bloodstone cores. But the electric kiln. I'm waiting with bated breath for these to be done. Which is the iron plates. So I can... Hmm. Iron plates. Compact motors and low filtration core. Okay. 
We need to get that sorted next time. Uh, <laughs> I'm very happy we got the barn done. I'm very happy that we got through so much of the uh, commissions. Good grief, it's been a long couple of days, hasn't it, really? Like, the first couple of days of the of the new year have been have gone by very fast. And I don't feel like... I don't feel like I got much done, but I think I kind of did at the same time. It's a weird thing. So I've got all my fish porridges now. That's very good. Let's have... Grace's daggers. How are they doing? Oh, where's the manganese? That must be done by now, right? Yeah, okay. The manganese is done, so let's get the daggers started. Also not sure why it decided it, it was sandy when it's not. Yeah, overall, pretty pleased with all of that. Definitely, definitely need a bit of a bigger <laughs> workshop yard, though. I mean, having increased the size of my shack and also uh, built a barn, built a stable, did not realise how big the barn was going to be. If I had, I would have maybe left space for it somewhere like in a corner or something. I might still be able to move it about. Maybe. I don't like it being in the middle of the yard, but I think it'd be easier to move things about once I've done the upgrade. So let's see how much that's going to cost me compared to how much I have. So it will cost me 50,000 goals. I have 12,000 goals. Quickest way to get to that 50,000 though is going to be doing commissions and quests. So let's get that done, I guess. Uh, so yeah, uh, from... Gonna go to bed now, from me and from all of the Yakmel and, <laughs> and all of the animals that I've stuffed into my yard. Oh, it looks nice in here though, doesn't it? When do I get the... Is it a relationship point thing? The eyes... Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? No, is it a gathering thing? A workshop thing? I don't even remember where it is, you see. There was one. There's definitely one that when you go to sleep. It's not combat. It's not combat, definitely. Oh, where is it? So irritating. There was definitely one that was like if you go to sleep by 3 a.m. And I don't think I've already taken it. <sighs> Hate it when I can't find a thing. It's definitely not there. I feel like it's a workshop thing. Moving speed. Oh, so it's just tucked away somewhere stupid, isn't it? Got a social run. Uh, it's really irritating. Here. Where is it? Gathering diamonds, salvage, kicking trees. Yeah, we are. It's under stamina knowledge. So let's go towards that. Let's get the extra stamina. So next time I get a gathering point, I can get that. I need to remember that. It's terrible. Oh, I looked everywhere for it. Gee. 
Eh. Let's get extra experience when I'm in top three, because I'm going to be in top three forever now. Makes absolute sense to do that, and then... I probably will end up unlocking the whole tree at some point. We've done quite a lot of it already, but that's time for bed for me. Sorry it took me so long to look through that uh, that thing, but I, I, I had no idea where it was. I completely lost it. But that's it for today's episode, so I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, then please uh, subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.